What is up guys, Cash back again, and it looks like things are about to start ramping up on the Spider-Man 2 news front as the game's official launch date draws nearer, and rumors suggest that a new PlayStation State of Play is rolling out very soon, which will give fans a new look at Marvel Spider-Man 2, and we're also getting new teases from the developers themselves about what's to come, so let's jump in and break it all down. So first up, the biggest story buzzing right now is the rumor upcoming PlayStation State of Play, which originally comes from Game Insider Jeff Grubbs, who said this over on his podcast. Odds of a second PlayStation Showcase slash first party focused State of Play before the end of the year, they were completely absent from Gamescon. Uh, like 90% for State of Play in September. And he has a pretty solid track record for being a reliable source on upcoming game info, such as revealing that EA was indeed working on a single player Black Panther game that was recently officially announced. And now rumors are suggesting that the state of play could come as early as this week, so we'll definitely be on the lookout for that official announcement from Sony. But moving over to Spider-Man 2 news specifically, Insomniac has become more active in the past week with marketing the game online by sharing new images of the game's heroes and villains, as well as showing the game's trailer in theaters, on top of releasing new info from a recent New York Times article that shared new images of some of the environments coming in Spider-Man 2 that showcase an upgraded New York from the previous games. Although the studio also revealed that unfortunately the Chrysler building won't be making a return due to licensing issues. But the team is clearly ramping things up despite some fans feeling the studio has been lackluster in terms of showcasing more gameplay and communicating what players can expect, to which another insider responded to online saying, well, this week is over now, which again suggests that this week could be the start of a new major marketing campaign for the game. And we also got this tease from the director of sound design saying, I'm not sure the world is quite prepared for what they're about to release upon it. And going on to say that in his opinion, Spider-Man 2 is the studio's best work yet. So it definitely looks like the hype train is getting ready to leave the station and players won't have to wait long to see more of Spider-Man 2 ahead of the game's official launch late October. But now I want to hear from you guys down below. Do you think we'll see a new state of play this week? And how do you feel about Spider-Man 2's marketing so far? Let me know down below and make sure to drop a like if you enjoyed the video and subscribe to keep it locked here for more Spider-Man 2 news and discussions. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.